there you go um absolutely as predicted download to tv glorious brilliant 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 um I guess it's good that I've got a tackler now. <laughs> One, two, three. He's only got four blodgers though. And a Roger and a Dodge. I don't even know what he's got on this team. Some things. I find it hard to care about what he's got there. He, he doesn't have that much blodge. So, hopefully. just sucks being down this much TV, doesn't it? That's the problem. Wizard and Borak. 13 men. It's like I can't think of anything else really. Oh, good old Lude Grip. Does he have a stripper? He's got a mighty blow. Kick. Wrestle, wrestle, wrestle. Edge 5. I mean, he hasn't got a lot. Has he got 14 players? Yeah, his team actually isn't that good. To be honest. Fucking hell, even the chef wouldn't be bad. Could have like, maybe he's got two, two babes and a bribe or something like that. But 13 players means that I can actually foul a lot, doesn't it? But then he's got 14, so do I want to foul a lot? Means he can dice us with some early removals and it not be the end of the world. His team doesn't seem that good, does it? He's got some kind of like drugs or the name of his. I think I'm allergic to metronidazole. <laughs> no, it's something else I'm allergic to. Um <laughs> Story. Chainsaw, no, I hate chainsaws. Oh, that's a good one, King Solomon. BLGF muted. Yeah, I don't know, this looks... Borak seems like... He's still a string five mighty blow beast, isn't he? But it just seems like... Maybe it'd be better to get, like, a... An apple, a babe, and a... An apple, a... An apple, a bribe, and a reroll might have been better. Maybe that would have been better. Chainsaw so bad it doesn't need to be on my piece of paper. I never, I'm never tempted to take a chainsaw. Ever. Ever, ever. Yeah, is any good, Sergeant Oddity? Could have been just like a tentacles minor. That might have been a shot, mightn't it? He's only got four blobs though, so. Scared of power tools. <laughs> He's all right in Ibarra, but maybe it would be... He is good. He's a significant upgrade to a rookie beast, isn't he, at the end of the day? Mm, he's kicking. Interesting strategy, Cotton. Things actually know what these models look like. I can, uh, I can put it on the upgrades only. Outguarded by, uh, <laughs> outguarded by. Oh no, we've got equal guard. Seven out of ten. All right. Well, I'd much rather have fifteen skills than Borak, but never mind. Yeah, it's true, Cobble, that's to be fair, like, it's just, it's just, it's disheartening because you know it's an unfair game, isn't it, more than, as much as anything. Um, but the fact he's got three reserves might stand him in good stead, but he usually isn't going to, is it? I 
I really hate not having block on, on best for goal because it makes him not even that good an option to carry in these kind of games where they've got like the edge five Saka. But there's edge five Saka's got to wrestle anyway, so I guess block isn't that good. <laughs> Fucking assassin. It's just starting with all the good players on the pitch, with all the levelled players. Arguable whether a levelled up assassin is better than a rookie witch. <laughs> Get the tackler back with best for goal. Replace this rookie beast man with a bad ass. He's a bad ass. So you can three dice the sidestep guy. A good chance of putting him down. Then he can hit him with mighty blow. Oh, there's another guy back here. I guess just blitz, blitz the assassin. <sighs> maybe with him, maybe not. I don't want him to get stabbed, do I? I don't want him to get hurt, do it, base, base, base. Safe moves first. Have some of that. This guy's the danger one. He can actually get blitzed already. That's crazy. Loner block. Let's go. Assassin being the LOS is pretty pretty cool actually, isn't it? Oh my god, fuck off. One, two, three, four, five, six. Actually, I can do this to um, to protect him, can't I? So he can't sidestep into blocking him. Yeah, of course it's a push. Brutal LOS bashing that was, eh? I 
I really just want the ball in my hand, don't I, against elves. He's the danger man. Seven was first to start with the loan block. Yeah, there's three dice there, wasn't it? Three dice with block, it was pretty safe. And didn't start with the loan block, started with covering the ball with the tackler. So there was that. Oh, Clive. A bit of a shame that I try to deal with the, uh, try to deal with the assassin and fail completely. <laughs> Didn't get splattered by Mighty Blow. Happy days. The yeah, armor's seven as well, ain't he? Gotta go for him. He's a bit balls to the wall, this chap, isn't he? Which is fair enough. I mean, he's. He's on a clock, isn't he? Even though, even though the mighty blows did nothing. Got two mighty blow guys and a claw mighty blow guy. He's on a bit of a clock, but can get right up next turn. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Can get right in the middle here. The question is, fish for a power on the mighty blow guy with 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 claw, which doesn't affect him, or get the guaranteed knockdown with tackle almost. Right, let's just go here first. That's number one priority. Safe moves first. Um, he wants to go there so he can block. Uh, but maybe not him. I think I want the tackler free next turn is most important than knocking somebody over with tackle this turn. All right. Do I take the double skulls there? I guess so. And here, I guess so. Right. Try to splat the armor seven. Could try again to splat him, I guess. I wouldn't hate it. Could hit a defenseless guy. Still got guard. Yeah. Good shout, Jimmy. go there it shows up him getting blitzed more doesn't it or here or here maybe well, I don't really want him to stab him but I really don't want him to get blitzed either he stabs him and stuns him if he, yeah this is actually this protects him just as well 
good. Dead. Rolled a nine. Good job he was basing a warrior and not a beast man. Imagine if I blitzed the mighty blow guy and I've had to do a fucking dodge away instead of killing him I've had to dodge away. It is pretty good to go for defenseless players sometimes, isn't it? He might have to greed this. Certainly in his head, I think he had to. Whether he whether he actually had to in real life or not. Well, it certainly worked out for him. <laughs> Lucky fucking bastard. Um, I've almost got to up all that. At least I've only got 15 seconds for a fucking game deciding decision. I guess losing the game isn't that bad. Down 400 TV. Got to keep. Got to think about keeping the team together long term in our way. Because 11-4-0 is is a really good record, to be honest. So can afford a can afford a loss. That was disappointing, wasn't it? I think he didn't have to re-roll it, but I can see why he thought he had to re-roll it. That's pretty. Now I'm outguarded. Outbashed and outguarded. No, okay. Equal bashed. But that's like being outbashed, isn't it? Against uh, elves. Oh, God, that was nice. That was a nice dodge fail. Shame it was only a. Shame it was only a lino. Right, can blitz him and then chain him out is the play, isn't it? And there's no real safe moves to do that in, I don't think. So I just want to see what happens with this first. That was disappointing, wasn't it? Okay, the result wasn't, though. Um, so now maybe blitz this guy and chain him out would be the play. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. Yeah. It's just that it's a block without anything, isn't it? But don't really want the ball in contact with a strength four bludger. Yeah. Of course, it's a bolt down. Oh, I didn't put in that square. Oh my, oh my days, I'm terrible. Lucky I got the pal then. I should have done it so that I didn't need the pal. But, didn't. Can we get a cage here? Yeah. Bit unlucky to have used two rerolls already, I think. But obviously, two cars. An apple gone is pretty good. Just quietly. Rolls are holding up well, yeah. No oh, man, fuck off. He gets one hit on him, Kaz's in. I mean, I can't even apple it. Because I have to think about the long-term health of the team. Get this is, this is the look here. I mean, yes, all right, I've done this, but I've got Claw and Mighty Blow, and he's got Armor Seven and Eight. For him to have just done that there, that's just fucking ridiculous, isn't it? Killer gets blocked once, gets cast. It's an absolute fucking joke.
Maybe I should have put the claw mighty blow guy there in the guard in front. I don't know. But then I have no guard left. Bashed to fucking death by these shithead minus armor dark elves. What the fuck is this? <laughs> what even is this? Holy shit. Have to go with the tackle pits now. I wanted to fucking blitz with Borak, but. Probably killed him. No. I'm going to make a two dice block, obviously, but then I want more guys forward, don't I? Need more guys forward. Run out of players at an, at an alarming rate due to this one dice fucking monster. You can probably get served here. I mean, if I'd wanted to win, I would have appled it. Um, oh, yeah, the Chaos title is wrong. Thank you. The title is wrong. That's good. Thank you. Forgot to change it. Also forgot to start the ads. Um... I mean, I shouldn't be complaining. I've got 13 players for this game, so, you know, got the reserves to cover these. But that, that yeah, if I was really trying to win, I would have appled this one, to be honest. But, you know, even then, yeah, this one's a huge one. But, what can you do? I can take a loss or two now, I think. So I think I'm going to go definitely more, uh, more pixel huggy. Um, with re regarding the uh, apothecary. That was a nice wrestle there for me, wasn't it? A, that's a good move. Well, I say that it's not really. <laughs> it's not really a good move. It's a shit move. <laughs> right. It's actually better to blitz with him anyway, isn't it? Because the both down there is going to be better. Like the push is good enough. 
So I actually wanted to bliss with the wrestle, not the tackle anyway. But then the tackle's got more chance of an armor roll on him. And I would like to armor roll on him. But a bolt down's pretty disastrous. Whereas this isn't. We go over here. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two. One, two. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Up, up, peace, peace, peace. Can punch him on the off chance. Got him. Good job he based him last turn, eh? <laughs> he ripped the rewards that turn. <laughs> Hello, 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 Jolly Deals. Yes, exactly, one King Solomon. It's tough, isn't it? Yes, that's what I generally do. Yeah, the first injury or key kill. Yeah, exactly. And if the first injury is in this game, it's tough. I mean, you know, in all these kind of situations, you want more than 15 fucking seconds to think about it, don't you? But, um, yeah, it's often really tough when it's a missed next game. But, I mean, obviously, this was a key badly hurt. I really should have appalled that. And I think I should have appalled this one anyway. If I was really trying to win, I would have appalled this one for sure. Because he's only got one mighty blow. It's not very scary. He's finally doing the cage dive. And gets knocked out for his troubles. Good. Fuck you. Right. So somebody... He wants to go... Forward. Block with block. He could block him, and then he can blitz, and then can get fully caged up. So he can block. Push him to there. He blitzes. One, two, three, four, five. He walks one, two, three, four, five. It's not good enough. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we can catch here. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Actually, having the guard at the back would be good, wouldn't it? Because he's a bit of a problem. Alright. Block without block. Brilliant. Don't even care. As soon as you don't have dodge, I think you want to keep him based. Rather than the guy who dodges win a two plus anyway. And now he can do the blitz. Or blots. I mean, 
least he's run out of players as well. At least he failed that fucking dodge in. Block, block, blitz. One, two, three, four. <laughs> oh, Pedro, I'm sorry, you know, either you got to do stuff like that, haven't you, when you're playing football? you got to count the squares. And think about who you're blitzing. He's just going to cage dive every turn now, by the looks of it. Which I guess is his best shot now. So that's not even... Like once he once he committed to it, it kind of became his his only option for the rest of the half, didn't it? But at least he's got options for it, I guess. Maybe I've played too bad to not see I really wanted the guard at the back there. But I went safe players first, getting the wrestle in the back. He dodged in through the tackle, that was that was not a good play. <laughs> <laughs> that was not a good play dodging in through the tackle right I do have written on my uh, on my sheet no surfs allowed but I'm kind of willing to make an exception here if I can Lucky cunt. All right, no surfs. <laughs> and he can blitz her at the end. I mean, it's quite easy to dodge in and get a 2 plus. Uh, but if he dodges in here, it's a harder dodge. And then he dodges in that way, there's guard. So, 1, 2, 3, double GFI. Ah, fuck it, I don't know. I don't know what to go for, the one, I guess not. Hope he fails. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. No, yeah, safe moves first, unbelievable. She is the law. Yeah, could have both down, but I mean, he's got jump up anyway, so. And then he's just going to wrestle it, so it just doesn't achieve anything, does it? This way, it forces him to make a 1 in 36 roll. He ain't going to fucking blitz. He ain't going to block with her. Pushes him the one dice, sir. Oh, punished. Outrageous. Outrageous punish there. When does that ever happen? Siri Rus Re. Alright, tackle and everything. his KO stays out, that's massive, isn't it? Well, both two KOs of his are pretty big. One KO of mine is really big. Well, like, one, one KO of mine is absolutely fucking huge. The hugest thing in the world. But he's got two ones that are even bigger. Strength 4 stays out, maybe. 
Shards back. Glorious. Yeah, Strength 4 staying out at the moment. Um, that's also movement 8, so the one turner is less likely. Still got 11 men's. I think he's that unlikely to score. I, d I don't think he's going to be able to do all the pushes for movement 7, to be honest. And the fact that he's got the stab as well means that I think playing it safe here is probably the best. He did save his reroll though for the one turn. So you never know. It's hard though, isn't it? I mean, one turner is hard. In terms of just rolling the dice to get it. This tackle's a monster, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the tackle's been pretty good this game. Move it, runner. Oh, he's got a move it runner. Didn't even see that fucking speed skating piece of shit. Yeah, I missed the movement A. I only thought that he, I thought he was the only movement A guy. All right, well now it's not as hard for him. <laughs> yeah, level up for best by goal is pretty good. I wonder if I could have a trump emote. That'd be pretty good, wouldn't it? Oh shit. I think he probably does. He saved his reroll for it, so I'm pretty sure he doesn't. Uh, movement A would have been a lot more scared of, to be honest. Fuck. Because it's like two more pushes to get a movement 7 now. I know, very easy jelly, we've still got to get the pushes. It's just rolling the pushes is the hard part, isn't it? Actually just rolling, physically rolling the dice. It's easy in terms of what to do. But it's, it's hard in terms of rolling the dice. Yeah, if I'd, if I'd spotted that movement 8, I would have I would have defended against it. Fuck. Oh, nice. Oh, that was a good rock. <laughs> well, that helps a little bit. No, he can't turn off sidestep. <laughs> Brilliant. That was an extra push that he he could have saved. Oh man, I wish he doesn't even have the stab. I was scared of the stab, and the the fucking stab was gone. I think stab is gone. I should have just set up to defend the one turn. Fucking bollocks. But I didn't know the movement eight anyway. Oh shit. The sidestep is actually meant that he could have done the movement seven pretty easily as well.
Uh, yeah, reroll gone at least. Yeah, the size that would have been really good for a movement 7 one turn. With a frenzy, but it still adds another push to the. Like with this, it just added another push. That was the problem. It, it really didn't need it. But now he's kind of almost got to try and get another push because otherwise I've got the intercept chance. I guess or he goes for a handoff as well. But they're both two pluses, so I guess he's got to go for a handoff now. Like pass handoff, obviously. And then he could try and get another push. He could have got another push if it wasn't for the rock, though. If it wasn't for the thrown rock, he could have done. Bastard. Would have quite liked him to stay out, just quietly. Could do this actually. This is this is this is oh this could be good against him. For the host, Jared TV. Could be my own man anytime. Oh, yeah, Phil wants to go over the block, yeah. That's a good point, Jelly Deals. So, yeah, he could have done. Um, I mean, he does have strength four on guard, so he, he can just crack this anyway, because he can just put guard there, assist there. I'll just, you know guards anyway so he can, he can crack this LOS but it's still it's at least it's a commitment from him to crack the LOS and it, these guys this all this formation makes it harder for him to blitz with uh, I don't really want to put guard in harm's way you can go four guard I guess this protects him a bit. It makes him hard to blitz with a witch elf. Or block with witch elves. Having the strength three and two friends is a bit of a disadvantage now, isn't it, for him? Six, nine, ten, eleven. He had eleven anyway. But it's really annoying that he gets. Obviously, Superman back. We got the wizard, so you never know. I really don't like guard on the LOS. But everyone else, nah, just him. Fuck it. Ah, oh, 
<laughs> I don't, I've got no idea what a new red feature is, but um, thank you for the host. <laughs> Yeah, I think definitely the standard's better than it used to be, but for the, for the most part, obviously, it's still not. You know, a lot of the games are going to be not not the, not very good coaches, <laughs> as harsh as that sounds. That's always going to be the case, though, isn't it? I mean, it can't not be. Like, if I was as good at Summit 1G is at first-person shooters, I'd be like... Holy shit, everyone who plays Call of Duty is crap. Whereas right now, I'd be like, oh, they're pretty good, aren't they? <laughs> On Call of Duty. So. Um, I don't think the niche affects that, to be honest, KLZ. Wow, it used to be. Oh, finally, one of mine gets hit by the rock. Mine gets KO'd. He's had two stunned. Okay, good. His gets KO'd as well. And his fucking movement, fucking eight, strength four guy gets the ball. Well, rookie rookie beast for Wrestle Witch is a decent trade, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's the thing. Veterans doesn't mean good, yeah. He got killed too, thank God. I mean, pissed off if, like, every time he got hit by a rock, he got stunned, and then my guy got hit and got killed or something. We'll be fouling on defence if we get the chance. I don't like uh, compromising position, though, at our Yeti, so... I mean, look, if I, if I bought that strength four guy and get the kick of his face off, then probably... Um, or, the, or the mighty blow guy or whatever but um, probably not I could foul if I can if I can get a good foul I will but it's just really hard on offence or defence to get a good foul in without compromising position isn't it which is why Skaven do it the best because Skaven just don't give a fuck about what's happening because they can just <laughs> they can uh, reposition the entire team easily, can't they? That was nice of him to use a reroll there, wasn't it? That was a bizarre. Like you know, he should have played safe. He should have made safe moves first, shouldn't he? If he was going to do that too, if he was going to, if like I did the other day, you know. Um, if you're going to do that move, you should make it safe. Forcing himself to re-roll, that was pretty bad. Right. I mean, there's obviously no chance of a bolt here. Block him, block him. Could even three dice with... Borak, but then it's giving away, giving up a blocking opportunity, isn't it? Which probably isn't the best idea. He could just hit a naked witch, witch elf. Seems like an okay use of his time. But he can stand. Disappointing.
can't re-roll this and it leaves a gaping hole. Phew. Which also the wrong side to surf. That was a pretty good rock in the end, I guess. Well, he's, he's drawn out the fireball or, or bolt, hasn't he, here, I think. Fucking movement eight strength four is a pain in the ass. Maybe I don't, but maybe I just slam in. Because if he scores next turn, it's not the end of the world. I mean, there's a lot of juicy targets for a five-man fireball. But half my team's on the wrong side, isn't it? I'd rather just slam in, get him to score, then I can use the bolt um, defensively, like offensively, to break through. Um, fireball here, what do I need? I need the ball carrier down, otherwise he just fucking passes it here or here. So... That already makes it shit and makes the bolt the only option. And people just aren't there to capitalize on bolt. So it's an easy decision to not use the wizard, I think. How about these safe moves first though? Unbelievable, Jeff. Of course, there's no armor break. So I can't even defend the sideline because it just gets served. Hopefully bang on him. So, I think he's going to score this turn. I think he basically has to score this turn. I, just can't, I couldn't, just couldn't get the ball off a five ball, though, could I? That's the thing. Of 
good afternoon, Duckster. I didn't like giving up this block, but I thought by giving it up, his strength four guy is committed. So that really encourages him to just score, doesn't it? And I think if he doesn't just score this turn, he definitely gets fireballed. Or bolted, whatever. Like, I don't think he can stall it. Or maybe, he, maybe he's going to try and stall it another turn. But I think I can definitely bolt him this turn. I think so, anyway. Come on, double one the dodge. Oh, that'd be amazing. I could even fireball this turn simply because I can mark the uh, the dump off recipients. I think he'll score. I think he has to. Oh, oh I think he'll think he has to. I think, I think this is a better fireball then. Because even if he doesn't go down, he can get double based, he can get double based, he can get double based, he can get double based. Like everyone can get based and just need this guy to go down to get two dice on the ball. And yeah, okay, I'm going to go for it. Don't think too much. Kill kill him, that seems okay. Cast him, that seems alright. And knock him over as well. And stun him. Yeah, it seems seems an okay fireball, I guess. I guess. Not bad. Not bad fireball there. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, GFI. Or one, two, three, four, five, six. So he gets the ball. The wrestle guy gets the ball. He's mighty blow, so he can just blitz there. Glorious. Right, so I need somebody here, don't I? To, uh... Well, I could foul the witch. Nah. Getting surfed by the witch seems a much better prospect. You could go here, I guess, to make the surf a little bit harder. Oh my god, made the pick up. Outrageous.
<laughs> Having words use of 150 TV, yeah, that was pretty good. 150k inducement killed a lot of players. Yeah, that was a hell of a wizard, wasn't it? Holy shit. I mean, last turn, I think it was a good time to use it, because I think, you know, it was a 75% to get... to be as good as a as a bolt. Um, but with extra chances, isn't it? So... Yeah, that was very lucky. Oh yeah, the rookie, the rookie warrior. Oh, he's quite far forward as well, isn't he? That was brutal, that wasn't it? Killed him. Oh, he's still standing. Yeah, I think he had to score. Or uh, even if he didn't have to score, you would have thought anybody would have thought they would have had to score that, wouldn't you? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Not all of them were four, 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 four two cats. Yeah, exactly. But it was incredibly lucky. Yeah. Incredibly lucky fireball. I did use a fireball and got zero. Yeah, Travica. I did. I did zero for six or seven one time. It was pretty ridiculous. I mean, that's the thing. And if you play a blood ball long enough, you're gonna get fireballs like four out of four for two cards, and you're gonna get one zero out of four for nothing, aren't you? So. You can't stop this being an uphill on the first block, at least. And he hasn't got block himself. Second will be a one dice. But then open himself for the surf. Anyway, the counter surf. So I don't think he'll go for the surf here. Or shouldn't go for the surf, should I say. I wouldn't mind scoring on the wrestle guy though, getting wrestle frenzy. the ball got a blitz oh do I have to blitz anybody one two three four five six so good chick cage up here one two three or five so here Not going to blitz with anyone good in the name of uh, safe moves first. Mm. He's in danger of getting surfed, isn't he? I guess he's just going to have to dodge away at the end. Could blitz him, then block him. I don't really particularly like um, hitting people without tackle, but there you go. If I get, if I get a lucky power here, I get the foul with two assists.
Could do a no assist foul over here. But that seems ridiculously dumb. Not bad. Satan was first, confirmed. Yeah, that's the thing, yeah, if they're gonna cage dive. Well, the strength four blocker could do it, couldn't he? With dodge, or the edge five wrestler is going to do it. There, there is his main his main sacking threat is edge five with wrestle, or strength four with dodge to come into the cage, aren't they? And uh, realistically, one's going to be uphill, and the other one's going to be one dice. I mean, the the wrestle wasn't on purpose. The wrestle ball carrier wasn't on purpose. He was just the. Uh, the only one who could get it. It is going pretty well, yeah. To say it was 450 TV down, it's gone pretty outstandingly well so far. There's still time for Best Forgot to get killed off. But yeah, that's pretty amazing considering there's not even much rowdiness on the team. Though two came from a fireball. As long as he's got players, I can't even risk the handoff, to be fair. Block him, see what happens. Could size step to there. If he does, he gets three dice by Borak. So, can live with that result. Borat could foul. Just three dice over there. three dice. Wow. Nothing. Would have bought down on all balls that didn't really care. Yeah, dodge into a KO and dodge one into a Kaz, I think. Yeah, you can. That would be pretty glorious to have the, the wrestle frenzy. Or even wrestle tackle, whatever, you know. More tackle, I guess, is, is good, isn't it? But at the end of the day, don't have to score. Just have to not get, not lose, <laughs> not not concede from here in it. Don't have to score. So, wow, I'd love to hand off to the Chaos Warrior. 
not going to make extra rolls to put the ball on the crown. Not against elves. He is at 10, yeah. But he could get the MVP, couldn't he? Uh, he's going in for the 1D. One direction. Failure to launch. There's a dirty player stood right next to him. <laughs> There's Borak. Alright, well let, let's make this safe two dice block with Mighty Bow first. Brilliant. And then a safe three dice block. <laughs> and a risky three dice block. Hmm. Hope I don't want an eighty one here. That could have been bad. Done just quietly. Still got a blutz to make. He can just dodge in on a 4 plus here to 1 dice. Which is a bit scary, isn't it? Could move the guard out to here. Make the foul worse, but makes it more likely to not get fucked on. No, I can't afford that. Oh, I could put him there. But the, the danger is coming in here, isn't it? Oh, I fucking fucked it up. I didn't want to move that there. Oh, bollocks. All right, don't get sent off. Oh, God, this is a nightmare. I should just not foul. Why did I do that? I can't believe I just moved him to the wrong side. Oh, God, that was really bad. Oh, that was so fucking bad. It was unbelievable. I'm going to fucking draw now. Wow. Wow, I can't believe it. I just misclicked the extra two squares. It was going great, but I misclicked the extra fucking two squares. Has he even got a guard in? Oh my god, he's got two dice on the ball. Holy shit. And <laughs> he's got the he's got the he's got the guy to score as well. <sighs> Unbelievable. Push him to here, won't he? Oh, here maybe would be better. But... Yeah, of course it is. Oh, fuck's sake, man. Oh, it was so bad. It was so fucking bad, just a misclick. It wasn't a decision. It wasn't a stupid decision. It was a fucking misclick. But I could have not, I could have not fouled. Once I'd misclicked, I could have not fouled. To be fair. I didn't need to foul after I'd done that. At least you can't score this turn. Wow, fuck's sake. Holy shit. Yeah, I should, just shouldn't have fouled. Should I? I could have just not fouled. <laughs> that would have been the play. Ugh. Oh, he's going to go for the pass. Oh, he did that. Oh, yeah, he's going to go for the pass, and so he can score this turn. Fuck. Oh, come on. Fail the reroll. Oh, 
you bastard. Haha, <laughs> what a fucking fucking Ah oh, fuck Oh man I just didn't need a foul, did I? Yeah, yeah, exactly. See, exactly. The one time a foul, it cost me a win. But no, I should. I should after I misclicked, I shouldn't have done the foul. Wow. I wasn't punished my hubris, was I? Wow. I was casual about the game was going, but I just I knew I'd fucked up when I moved him and still fouled anyway. There was I just didn't have to foul. I just did not have to foul. Fuck's sake. Ugh. I was worried about him getting in the back on the four plus. Which would have been a bit of a danger, but at least he couldn't have scored that turn if he had. Wow. Wow, it's annoying. I don't think I've used a reroll all game. <laughs> Maybe one both down. Yeah. No tunnel vision in it. Don't get tunnel vision, that's the thing. Oh, fuck. I'm just going to go down this side because there's there's more space, isn't there? Although these are witchy elves, he, he can sidestep, and getting sidestepped on is not really a good idea. What the fuck is this shit? Someone's knocking on the fucking door, really. They can fuck off, I don't even care who they are. So fucked. One, two, three, four, five, six. So he could use all of his movement there. Got two beast men to fucking do something. He can, I guess he blocks there and then he goes in. No, he blocks there and he goes in to here. Right, be right back. It wasn't the police. Oh man, what a fucking, what a fuck up that was. What an absolute fucking idiot. I just found a way to lose. 
Well, now he's get the rep. Oh, I'm a perfect kick. Of course. He doesn't even have a kick anymore. Tackle, tackle doing something again. Tackle hasn't been that bad, has it? To be fair. <laughs> This is so bad though. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI, G. I mean, he can probably just come in and sack me. One, two, three, four, five, six. I guess he can't. I've got to go for the pass on the last turn. And if he's there. I can probably do some blitz chain or something. If he's there, then it, he's seven away, isn't he? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, he's a GFI away. Oh, well. Maybe I could go for the pass. I just don't want to go for the pass, do I? One, two, three, four, five, six. Then next turn. One, two, three, four, five, six. Pass handoff. I just literally can't even try anything because if I get in a range of getting blitzed by him, he'll blitz me. He can base me. That was dumb, I guess, going for that block. But I wanted to move him. I guess I should just moved him across. Should just moved him across to like here. No, I fucked everything up this turn. I mean, I'm in tilt now because I'm just playing shit. Yeah, I don't know who the fuck it was. It wasn't there when I went. <laughs> what an idiot. Yeah, from the team, but the way the game went, that's the thing in it, TLC. The way the game went, I just punted it. And it never feels good to punt a win, does it? I just had the win, guaranteed, and I fucking pissed it away because I was idiotic. I was I, I should not have fouled. <sighs> Should not have fouled them. <laughs> yeah, I would have taken a draw from the get-go. But it just went so fucking perfectly. And then the one foul that I made <laughs> got punished for the one foul. But it would have been alright if I'd moved if I'd moved if I'd just left the guard where where he was, fuck's sake. It's like, like on the game against Fash. Like the game against Fash, and I was like, I couldn't move here. Maybe I should, shouldn't do things like that, eh? Uh, that's, that's something to write down the sheet. Don't do, uh, don't path speculative moves. That's a long sentence, isn't it?
No, he's doing chains. I knew we could do chains if I did this. But if I moved him there, I knew it would let him do chains, but... What can I do? I might be able to chain him back, you never know. I mean, it looks like it's really easy now to clear a path with blocks and a blitz. Looks incredibly easy to clear a path. And he's still two GFIs away, isn't he? Thanks to movement seven. One, two, three, four, five GFI. Yeah. So just a pass from him. Probably four plus pass. No, that's not a bad shot. That is though. Right. So, need a push here to get rid of the uh, guard assist. Don't get rid of the guard assist. Cannot re-roll. Brilliant. What a great start. Now I need a one dice here. Good, push is enough. Oh, I still had the blitz. Oh well, didn't need to do that because I, I didn't I didn't need the blitz, so I could have just uh could have got two dice there. Never mind, eh? I I was still in my head, I still tunnel visioned it that he moved his witch elf there. Right, so two GFIs. Um, I guess I could blitz this guy now. One, two, three, four, five. That's a four plus. That's a four plus pass, isn't it? All right, fuck it, just go. That's going to be easier than handoffs anyway. Not blue. Yes. Oh, thank God. Oh. Thank God. Thank God. Best Fagor. Movement seven was was fucking. Instrument, it's been instrumental, hasn't it? Best I got the greatest. Oh man, <laughs> snatching a win out of self-inflicted draw. Yeah, exactly. That's fucking ridiculous. I proper punted it, and then the dice got it back. Maybe his play, but I don't know. I, I think he, I think he played pretty well overall. To be fair. But um, he certainly got banged on, didn't he? It was this eight or oh, six for best for go. Sex and bones with the MVP should be Sextus. Um, what do we have? Um, yeah, it was all right, wasn't it? Good, good rolls overall. Jimmy, you truly are just like a Lupac. I really am. I've turned into a Lupac just having to roll dice to win. It was my fault that I hadn't won already. Holy shit. Alright, what's this? Let's have a look. Oh, that's Stefan. Wrong team. Sorry, this is really, I should really fucking mute right now. Okay, I'm gonna mute and be right back in a second.
This is more like Lupac UNSK 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 DJ spin that shit. <laughs> unsk, unsk, unsk. Spin this shit. Yeah, that was that was really terrible. That was really fucking terrible. Yeah, he played. He did play well. Um, ish, apart from maybe when I think he should have scored and didn't. Um, you know, and he should have been punished for that if I hadn't been a complete fucking idiot. I guess it got me more star player points by getting the by getting uh, the completion rather than just a touchdown on the wrestle guy. Um, ah, block anyway, it's got to be block. Block is just literally too good, isn't it? Block is just too good to not have. Um, thank you, oh, Narnia. <laughs> um, yeah, it wasn't terrible, yeah. <laughs> what, there was a massive bullshit worm thrax, yeah, because I misclicked, which should have, all the misclick should have done was stop me fouling. But instead, I was tunnel visioned into thinking that I must foul. Fouled, got sent off predictively, exposed the ball to a two dice, got two dice. I mean, he, his score was a bit bullshitty, to be fair. And then he scores, it was 1 1, and then uh, got the fucking two turn at the end, thanks to Movement 7. So, yeah, the, the Movement 7 has been outstanding on Best for Goal. Um, to be fair. And now, now it's paid off as well because now it's the second level. It's not even, he's not even missing block anymore. And obviously, we'll try to get him sure hands on the next normal dodge if he ever rolls a double. And then I guess like two heads and, and then tackle. But I mean, I, he's probably not going to live that long. But um, your piece of paper, Jimmy. Don't expose your balls. Yeah, <laughs> thanks. <laughs> Don't expose your balls. No, that's that's a that's good advice. Words to live by. But there you go. Jammed it in the end. Lou packed it properly. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.